Why can't people protest? It is their right. We are worse than what we used to be. Umar Damagum. The acting national chairman of the PDP, Umar Damagum, emphasized the fundamental rights of Nigerians to protest, stating that their current sentiment of discontent is justified. He compared the present situation in the country to past protests during Good Luck Jonathan's administration, drawing parallels to historical instances of citizens expecting, expressing dissatisfaction. Notably, Damagum highlighted that citizens have previously taken to the streets when they believed that things were not functioning properly. He further emphasized that given the perceived deterioration in the country's condition, it is understandable for people to feel the need to protest today. This sentiment was echoed by former PDP presidential candidate Atiku Abubakar, who had earlier shown support for the upcoming protests. Damagum stressed the importance of upholding citizens' rights to voice their grievances, underlining the necessity for people to have the freedom to protest when they feel the government is not adequately addressing their concerns. Ultimately, Damagum's remarks validate and support the rights of Nigerians to engage in protest activities as a means of expressing their legitimate concerns and seeking redress for the challenges they currently face. As he said, we are Nigerians and we are feeling the same way like them today. We are worse than what we used to be. So why can't people protest? It is their right. Well, what are your opinions on this? Make sure to leave them in the comments down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And make sure to hit the bell so you can be notified when we upload daily content here on this channel. And don't forget to share this video with your family and friends so that they know what is going on and they can give their own opinions on this. Now, let's see what other people have to say about this. What I know about protesting is you put your view on a paper and send it down through your lead leaders to the government, avoid anarchy. We are two elephant fights, it's the grass that suffer. We are going to see the beginning of we are going to see the beginning, not all of we see the end. What the opposition politicians lost during the election. They want to gain it with protest. Is it by force to rule when you lose at the poll and lost your bid at the various courts you try to corner victory? It would not be business as usual. Let the gullible followers rethink before going out on the 1st of August through the 10th. Nobody is against the protest, but those who call for or sponsor the protest in one way or the other in one way or another, leave the protest along, along with their family and control the crowd. That's when the protest will, will be complete. The only sensible statement this man called Damagum has made ever since. Will your own children come out too for the protest? Stealing is bad. After stealing mandate, the whole idiots in power are not respected again because we all know they are thieves in our hearts. Umar, you are one of the thieves in PDP. There is no time to rewrite the error we are currently inside, inside fire. He should cut down the price of petrol and everything will come back to normal. This country is not okay at all. The APC is the wrong, is the wrongest of political parties to join. Buhari, Shoinka, Tinubu and others lead protests during Jonathan. Buhari entered seats, the protest turned haram to which Tinubu and the rest not or no, no talk up till when they killed unarmed protesters. Today, chairman protester at Tinubu, they sit. If we for North now don't get voice to call for protest and it is no longer haram because no be Northern man. Likewise, Tinubu against protest now. Because he is in power. When your brother Buhari was messing up this country, opening the treasury for the then cabals, it was not worse. 
it is now a man with sincere approach and focus trying to clean up the mess of eight years of monumental corruption is trying his best. That is when the country is worse. In which way did Atiku echo the sentiments because he said protest is a right to citizens and which you agree to it? If you mention Atiku's name, your talk is not complete because of your support to Wike and you, Damagum, you are one of the cause to Nigeria's problems by allowing Wike to hold PDP into ransom because of his personal interest and not Nigerian's interest. You are encouraging protests because we have a southern president bearing the burden created by Buhari. What a hypocrisy. You are right in every way because Tinubu shopped for Buhari and offered him to Nigeria even when he knows the man has nothing to offer but for selfishness. They had their agreements. You scratch my back, I scratch your back. That is where we are today. But he needs time to rewrite his errors. Well, what are your opinions on this? Make sure to leave them in the comments down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And make sure to turn on notifications so you can be notified when we upload daily content here on this channel. And don't forget to share this video with your family and friends so that they know what is going on.